Hello and welcome to another video of the explaining series. Today we're gonna look at one free Aloran Ruins as the last voting has shown. Again, be sure to vote for the next map. I'm gonna put a voting right here. And yeah, that's basically all I gotta say. Let's just get straight into it. So what you want to do at the start is you wanna go one, two, three, and then about halfway or even three quarters, three quarters of the next block if from the glass um, to stray from about there or there. So let me just play the video and show you how it's done. Uh, so you jump here and then use a strafe. Don't use another strafe, just keep jumping here. Try to uh, keep your momentum here. Don't stop jumping. Keep jumping here. That's that's the most important thing. Don't use two strafes at the start. Use one strafe and then keep jumping here. That's important. Then you can go up here. Try not to um, try not to clip here that block. Then get head hitters right there. Go out again to take the stairs, and then do one, two jumps. And then with the second jump, I can show it again. You're at the top one, two, and then strafe. Um, so you will stray from about, oh, I forgot. You will strafe from about here. If you land on that block and then be about there when you strafe. Because the important thing is to not clip this, clip the top of the portal here. And so that was pretty close here. Um, so you could have done it a little bit better. Then you can go into the head hitters right there. Try not to click the soul sand. It's a bit hard sometimes. I do it often too, sadly. Then just keep jumping here. This is a pretty straightforward part. And then go into the head hitters again. Go as far as you can. Don't uh, stop hitting your head uh, like here. Just go, f just go like about there, about here where the stairs are. You can stop and go in again. And if you reach that portal at twenty nine seconds, you're on a good pace. Keep jumping here. You'll make the auto trap easily because you use two strafes there. Then walk your way there, and then from the green block, do a strafe, and you will land on the red block. Then take the stairs. Try not to clip here. It's a bit hard sometimes. Make the quad jumps, go up the stairs again. Again, don't clip it, that's important. Then take the head hitters. Here it's important that you don't clip the top of these dispensers. It will cost you like, I don't know, 0.4 maybe uh, when you clip them. So it is, it is really bad if you do. So just try to make it like that. And then as soon as you get your strafe ready, use it. And then walk, make your way up there. Um, what I can I can recommend you to um, not like spam spacebar. For example, at um, at these stairs, I would recommend spam spacebar as fast as you can. Just try to spam as fast as you can. But at the last stairs, don't just try to be a little a little less aggressive, maybe um, with your spacebar because. It will just make you clip. At least for me, it's like that. I don't know. Speed stairs are always a bit weird. For me, it's like that. I think it's a bit better to not spam, but like spam a bit slower. <laughs> Does that make sense? Anyway, that's how to get a one three point eight six nine. Um, I hope this video helped you. I hope you enjoyed it. And with that all said, see you in the next video.